Hello to all the Reborn Mommies and Daddies out there. Happy Friday to everyone. I'm here with a changing video. Yesterday I did a changing video of my sweet little preemie twins. And today I will be doing a changing video of my sweet little Anastasia Noel. And she is the Princess Charlotte Scope by Nikki Johnston. Johnston. So let's get started. So, oh, sadly, I have to take her out of this super sweet Winnie the Pooh outfit. And I will be putting her in a cute little, uh-oh, hmm, this doesn't, okay, stay. I'm going to have to find somewhere else to put this because it's like doing its own thing. Okay, okay, you let me see. That's still it's pretty good. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. There we go. Sorry for the interruption. So, as you can see, um, she is just a super sweet baby. Anyone out there that have this scope, this scope art is another one. Um. I don't know the name of it, but I've seen it. It has the same limbs, but it has a slightly open mouth. And the face is slightly different. But this kit is so cuddly. Like, as far as for me sitting up and just to have her just um, lay her head on my chest. And, you know, it's she is just so... She's... Uh, I really enjoy snuggling. This little one. Very much so. I have a lot of fun snuggling this little girl. Oh, and her, she actually has a Winnie the Pooh onesie on underneath here. So, I hope everyone had a wonderful Friday. I had uh, two parent teacher conferences scheduled, but neither one of them showed up. So, we just did our ethics training and I got prepared for a uh, Tuesday. And that was pretty much it. And I, um, uh, it got kind of cold in there. Without the kids there, it's not, you know, as much body heat to keep, uh, you know. So, I mean, it's already cold in there. And with us not really doing anything, it uh, was even colder. So twice we went outside to take a little walk just to kind of warm up a bit. And other than that, we just kind of um, just uh, played on our cell phones and such. So that's what we did. Um, I am excited about our three-day weekend we have. So excited about that. Who wouldn't be excited about a three-day weekend? I know I am. So, as I was driving home, I was kind of playing with the idea of maybe stopping by Burlington's or, 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 or Target, Walmart, whatever. And then I was like, nah, I'm just going to go home. I don't, I don't feel like shopping for um, anything for myself, the babies, nothing. And I really have been... Like, not as interested as, uh, you know, as, as far as, like, shopping for my babies uh, lately. And I and I think maybe it's just probably just because, uh, just, just trying to watch out for the finances and such. I'm guessing that's what's going on with me. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's a pretty much it. Um, and I just feel as though, like, I just have so much uh, for my babies. I just want to come home and just enjoy what I already have. So that's what I'm doing. So I figured um, instead of running around getting myself even more tired, I will just 
Well, maybe I could just leave it on this snap. I would just come home and just change a baby and just relax. So that's what I'm doing. And it's her turn. And after her, it will be Mr. Elijah's turn. And then we start all over again. Fun, fun. Uh-oh. Fun news. Uh, my little sweet Denver Rose made it to his or her artist on um, yesterday. So that was cool to find out. So I'm excited about that baby. And it's like, uh, I just find myself just trying to find excitement in my hobby without, you know, spending gobs and gobs of money. You know, the box openings and the shopping definitely, you know, it, it um, it's, it hits those sensors, those happy sensors. So this is the little onesie. It's just a cream color. And her diaper is purple. It's a, a cloth diaper. And it has a little smiling kitty face. Not, it doesn't have the ears and everything. It's just the eyes, the nose, kind of the little mouth, and two little whiskers. The little whiskers are like a pink. And the eyes, or and the nose is pink like a rose pink and the eyes and the little mouth part is kind of like of a, a burgundy type of color. It matches the um, jacket and the pants. The pants are a rose pink and that same kind of burgundy color. I'll show that in a minute. The pants are, um, the burgundy stripe is uh, a skinnier stripe and the rose color stripe is a fatter a more thick, uh, is thick, a thicker stripe. There we go. So I have been thinking of downsizing since I have three babies that will be here at uh, some point or another. I was wanting to possibly downsized by two at least two babies and i have the babies uh that i want to downsize in mind i just um i just have to see how i'm gonna do that so yes but um i am not 100 percent yet so we shall see. So here are the little pants right here. This little stripy color. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna get those on her. And this is a three month size Little Wonders brand. I believe I got it uh, when one store was going out of business. A store was going out of business. Uh, Sears or something. And while I was in Temp Home, you know, I had picked up a few things like a lot for Cassie. And that's my six month size grant. Baby, I, I have like not, um, I told myself I wasn't buying anything else for him um, until he gets here. And I probably still won't buy anything else for him because. Oh, darn. I hate it when I grab that by accident. Because of the fact that he just has so much already. And I think I'm going to let him wear some of the stuff I got that I purchased for him already. So, this is what the little outfit looks like so far. There we go. And she has on some little just plain white frill frilly little socks and here are her shoes they are like a hot pink well they're not they're kind of like they kind of match this so it's kind of perfect for it um and they have big hot pink bows and the shoes themselves are kind of like a patent it has like a little film on it and they're sparkly they're sparkly sparkly um like hot pink 
And some of the sparkles in there are like silver, it looks like to me. And here's her little jacket. It's like this burgundy pink color. And it says, so cute. And the O in the so is a kitty cat. A white cat with the same um, color of the, like the face part, the little face parts, the whisker and the eyes. It's the same color as on the little onesie. And she just has a little pink burgundy little bow on the uh, left side of her head. And yes, and the S is uh, that rose pink. There's a C in turquoise. The U is white with the little burgundy stitch. The C has a white stitch. Uh, it's just kind of like little designer stitches on it that kind of outline the letters. The T is a... Oh, that's my cat. My cat is just running. I just heard my cat just run across, <laughs> run across the uh, hallway. The T is a lime green, and it has a designer little white stitch in it. And the E is the pretty rose color um, with the little pink burgundy stitch, and it has the little bur a burgundy heart for the hole in the E. So I'm gonna get that on her, and oh, also the C has a little rose pink little bow at the top of it, a little ribbon bow at the top. So I'm getting, I'm putting her little jacket on her now. I mean, it's not cold here yet. It gets kind of cool, slightly cool at night and it's like slightly cool um, first thing in the morning, like about 60. Like kind of mid sixties kind of, and that's like because uh, sixty three is what we keep the house. Wait, that's not right. Seven seventy three. Wait, seventy three. Yes, no, I don't know. I think it's seventy. I think we keep it seventy three degrees in here, and it, and during the day. We bump it up to 76. There. I would say 73 is very comfortable for us. So I decided to change my little baby, use our little changing table area. So this outfit looks super cute on her. She's a perfect three month size. And she can fit zero to three month as well. But this little three month size outfit is perfect on her. I want to get her a little hat. So I'm going to put her little shoes on. And I'll show you guys those once I get them on. I didn't have any socks that would perfectly match this outfit. So that's why I just went with the white. Oh, but yeah, I was wondering what I was going to match these shoes with. And this is definitely an outfit. Remember, I tried to put these shoes on Cadence with her little outfit, and it was not working. But they look super sweet on her. <laughs> super sweet. I love, love, love it. So let me see if I can find her a hat. I'm going to use her pacifier that came with her. It's a, uh, um, it's a circular shaped pacifier with a white handle and it has little holes, like, um, little holes going around the pacifier. Actually, that's the pacifier that came with her from her artist. Oh, I have nowhere to clip this and see, even this is like a perfect color to kind of match her letters. It's slightly lighter than it, but it's pretty close. Hmm. Where can I put this? I, I don't like... Oh, my goodness. I do not care for um, clipping it, like, awkwardly. There we go. Like, on the clothes. Uh, it has to have somewhere I can clip it. All right, let me find her a little hat and while i do that i'll kind of just let you guys see her little outfit doesn't she look super sweet i am about to cuddle snuggle wuggle her 
All right, let's go over here where I left a drawer. The sock drawer is a jar. Oh my goodness. Shame, shame. So putting her other shoes up here. She's a perfect shoe baby. She fits the size, uh, actually newborn. It's her perfect, but she has bigger feet. I let you know that they make the shoes too big. So we were looking for a hat. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. I don't see anything that really matches that. Maybe I'll just put a big bow on. Been having a hard time like matching hats up. <laughs> I'm not putting any mittens on her. I'm gonna let her have some freedom there. Let's see. What do we have here? Hmm. It's kind of cute, but there's no silver in that. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe this one. This one looks ugh. Wrong color though. And the camera doesn't look that bad. But it's not the right color. Oh, I I need. I am not doing well with like hair accessories for the babies. I've been struggling with that. I'm gonna plug in their back lights. Here we go. It's their little lights that I've gotten from Five Below. I'll just plug that in. Um, hmm. She needs something. Something. Anything. Let's see. I have this little purple ribbon here. Whoa. From uh, um my box opening with my sweet little Elijah there. Let's try tying a bow. Let's see what it will look like. OMG, I just did something so precious. I am going to delay showing you because it's just so precious. No, that's not the right one. Anastasia. There we go. It's so precious. I have to delay. Oh, look at all the baby claws. Just baby claws everywhere. That's what I've been trying to do. I've been trying to cut down on the spending and more, you know, let's wear these things instead of spending so much money. So, um, my newborn babies definitely have plenty of stuff. The boys have some cute stuff. And if I make my Denver Rose a boy, these will be cute things for him. But these are things that will fit, um, uh, Elijah as well. I want to put somebody in this. Isn't that cute? Maybe I'll put Elijah in that next. He's next. I might put this on him. Let me sit this right here. So, without further delay, I tied her a little white bow. And that also came from Kimberly. Isn't that just the most preciousest thing ever? I have to get some more little bow, little just ribbons like this, just to tie in her hair. Isn't that just so sweet? Oh, I love this baby. She's so sweet. She's near and dear to my heart. She's super cute. She is absolutely super cute. The only thing that I would change about her would be like for her, like her to have a swirl and for her to be like a couple of shades darker. Like if she looked more like a, um, what's what I'm looking for? Like that baby over there. What What's that called? Biracial. If she looked more biracial, that would be so awesome. That would be so awesome because I could take her out because she could kind of pass, you know, as mine, you know. But anyways, but she's, I still love her to pieces. She's still so cute. But she hangs out at home though. <laughs> and I just take, I would take her to my mom's house or something like that. Um, yeah. So... Oh, who's that? Oh, that's Cat. That's little dude. If any of you guys have been 
wondering if he's okay. There he is. He hasn't licked any fur off or anything. So I don't think he's stressed or anything. He's still the same little lovey-dovey kitty. <laughs> yeah, are you a lovey kitty? Yeah. Yeah. Would you like to get a new brother or sister? Maybe. You like it just being you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you so lovey. Yeah, you so lovey. Say, yeah, mommy love you. I've been spoiling him rotten. He like can do whatever he wants. I just spoil him rotten. Say, yeah, mommy just spoils me. She just lets me do whatever I want. <laughs> He's so sweet. How could you not spoil that sweet baby? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I love him. It's our only little fur baby now. <laughs> what? Mmm, <laughs> sweetness. You making some, some air biscuits? Are you making some air biscuits? Yes. Oh, look at that face. Are you a sweet boy? Hmm? Are you a sweet boy? Are you a sweet boy? Yeah. No, I know. I know you're a sweet boy. And that's my elephant pillow, so you guys could really see it. I love that. It's an animal plush chair. I got the elephant. Dream. No, it's covering the elephant face. So, you know. I'll move it back. Kind of right here. Eh, there. My dream pillow. My Make Today Awesome and Cotton Candy's up there on the Make Today Awesome. Oh, she's kind of falling though. Let's see. Yeah. There. All right. So, yeah. I don't think you guys want to see me. Do you want to see me? Oh, look, do I look at happiness. Do I look at happiness. <laughs> do, do I do I look at happiness? Yes. A little bit. A little yes. Big, big, little, big, little. Hi, silly. Um, I want to just sit and chat with you guys, but I don't want to bore you guys to death. I had an idea of making some cute little um, crochet little Santa uh, hats for two of my babies. Because I'm not going to sit and like crochet nine Santa hats. So, yeah. So that was a thought, but... <laughs> I don't crochet like I haven't crocheted in a while and it's just just to sit still long enough to get started I don't really like to stay still that much and when I do stay still I just like to do just that just stay still and not really concentrate on much of anything that's what I kind of like to do but anyway let me get back up I'll show you guys all of the babies again. And like I said, I don't know which baby would I adopt out because I just love all of my sweet little babies. They're all super sweet. But um, like I said, with three coming, I don't know. I just don't. You know, when those numbers start to get up there, you start getting kind of antsy and overwhelmed. And I don't want to do that. So, yeah, my, I have my plan that I want to do, but I need to speak to, uh, some people <laughs> about it first and yeah, but look at her. She looks super adorable. She can kind of like stand up on her own. She's a big girl. Huh? Say I'm a big girl. Mm -hmm. I'm a big girl. Mm -hmm. I'm a big girl. Mm -hmm. She's so cute. Look at those little shoesies. She's a big girl. Yep, yep. She's my little big girl. Okay, come here. Ugh. There, mommy's got her. And she spit out her passy. She's so sweet. I just love her. But that's it. I need to like, go to the Dollar Tree and see if I can find something kind of cute and whimsical to kind of put around those pictures. Like some cute little, like some shooting stars or something cool to kind of match my little theme. 
like I said, I really need to go somewhere else because see, these don't really stick that well. These are kind of like falling off the wall. I mean, they don't fall off. They just kind of come loose. I just press them back up on the wall, but they never, they haven't fallen off. Um, but yeah, so I think I'm going to get this little guy changed next. So I'm going to lay his sister down. Oh my goodness. I want to cuddle her. She's the cutest. I just love her to pieces. There we go. Isn't her outfit cute? It's like totally made for her. Three months is totally her size. So I'm going to get brother now and I'm going to get him dressed in this cute little Tigger outfit. And I'll probably just share some pictures on Instagram. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoy our little changing video. And those are, there are the sweet little um, reborn uh, preemie burritos there looking super sweet together. Uh, I just love my little twins. So sweet. But anyway, I'm out of here. Um, just give you a gander around the room. Nothing has changed. It's all the same. But that's it. Uh, it was nice chatting with you guys for a little while. And I will see you guys in the next video. Excuse if you see that gum in my mouth. I try not to chew it when I'm talking, but I chew it because so that I don't eat anything like while I'm kind of here if I get bored. So I kind of keep the gum in my mouth to kind of keep me from wanting to eat. But anyway, that's it. Peace. Bye-bye. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.